news with Luke and Christopher on the front page. Guys, congratulations on the picture. Margot, lovely to see you. Um, you. And Donald, lovely to see you as well. <laughs> in terms of the movie, Daphne's character was so interesting to me because she's so complex. I mean, she's a mother, but yet she abandons her child, which, as we all know, is serious psychological issues, which, of course, is addressed later in the film. That must have been tricky to play. It, it, it's it's a really lovely challenge to play a less likable character. Mm. Who you and kind she of, was, which was awful yeah, as a mother. But, but it, it, by the end of the film, you kind of give that or give hopefully the audience can empathize with her in some regards and turn their point of view and and let them see things through her eyes even for a glimpse is is a nice challenge because it was a lovely juxtaposition at the end where she's crying mm -hmm. um i mean crying on cue i would imagine is not easy how many times did you do that i did a soap for three years so crying on <laughs> cue is like kind of kind of like part and parcel of being on that's what it is how hard is it though yeah. margo I, when i was on neighbors honestly i could pick an eye i was like which eye should it the teardrop well, that ruins, that ruins it. That ruins it. I was much better back then than I am now, but yeah, it was well, just like, true. it was... I, you had to cry on cue as well, though, Donald, in fairness, you had to no, as well. No, but that took me ages, that, and that isn't on cue. Like, I, I, I found it, like, because we, we only, the, the scene with you uh, towards the end, um, they only had to do a couple of times. It took me longer. What do we fight that war for? Well, it is over. What am I doing about it? You're doing what you're good at, writing plays. I didn't know Winnie the Pooh that well when I, I, I used to have Bran the dog and stuff when I was a kid. So Winnie the Pooh was not really on my radar. I knew who he was, but that was it. I knew what the books were. That's not where the interest lay for me in the film. It was, it was in the relationships with the people in, uh, and how it was so complicated and so layered. That was of much more interest to me than the fact that uh, he had written Winnie the Pooh or even that he was a writer. I just thought the way that you rescue yourself from trauma was, um, was what interested me in the first place. So I think that's a different approach. Now there is talk of Oscars for this film. Is there? That? Yes, there are. I, I'll be honest, you're the first person to mention you're that. The so first I think box office starting is that. always I here with the, the first the good news. From box office. We only um, deliver good news, Mark. Yeah, yeah. Um, what are your Congratulations. thoughts on that? <laughs> Holy we want God. it on one second. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> my ma'am, my lovely ma'am. <laughs> Margo, what's your thoughts on that? Oh, I mean, just you go. <laughs> oh. Ah, uh, will you thank my ma'am? <laughs> no, yeah, yeah, yeah. He has to be allowed to grow up. He has to know he's important. Radio interview, newspaper interview. He can't do all this. He's rather good at it. He's a little boy. Brought to you by Virgin Media.